after making the program's first NCAA tournament appearance since 2017. Coach Charles, we'll begin with your opening statement. Yeah, good morning. Um, I'm not one for great opening statements, but I'll give it my best shot here. Um, it's good to be back here, obviously. Um, I'm a little biased to the Big Ten tournament being in Indianapolis, but I thought Minneapolis really, really rocked it last year. Um, it was just uh, the environment around the city, um, the fans, um, every, everywhere we, we walked last year was just a, a great place to be. So if it can't be in Indy, I'm, I'm solid with it being here. Um, you know, last year I think we, we, we took a great step for our program, getting back into the tournament. While be it a play-in game, we were just excited to have that experience. Um, got a good solid five back this year. Um, then we had two sophomore transfers out of the portal and then six freshmen. Most days I think I'm crazy for having six freshmen on my team, but uh, it's, been a, it's been a really fun challenge and just a lot of great energy in our program right now. Um, like a couple, couple non-conference challenges, we, we open at UCLA. Um, we're starting, starting things back up with Notre Dame, so we'll play at Notre Dame. Um, and then obviously the gauntlet of the Big Ten. So hopefully our non-conference uh, schedule challenges us enough, uh, enough to get ready for the Big Ten. Uh, but uh, just excited to get things going. Thank you, Coach. We'll open the floor for questions for Coach Gerald. Third row on your left side. Uh, Todd Golden with CNHI. Uh, Katie, you got a core of, uh, of Janae and uh, Abby and, and, and Caitlin coming back. How have they kind of challenged themselves to cut, kind of continue to climb the mountain that you started to climb last season? Yeah, I think that, that just says a lot about who they are. Um, you know, both Janae and Abby are in their fifth year. They took their COVID year, and, and Caitlin's in her sixth year. Um, and then you throw in Madison Layden, who's a senior for us, and then Jayla Smith, who, who is a junior. Those are our five core. But um, I think they're just hungry. Um, I think we got a little bit of a taste of it last year, uh, where, where we want Purdue to be. And, um, you know, I think it starts with those five uh, and, and their leadership. Their, their ability to lead our young people right now has just been tremendous. Uh, makes makes our job easy um, from a coaching standpoint, um, and really just kind of the, give them the give them the ball and, and kind of let them lead the way. And as coaches, we'll just try to get out of the way as much as we can. Straight back. Good morning, coach. Good morning, Christy Winter Scott, Big Ten Network, with the six freshmen. What have you seen from your core group of five returners in terms of their leadership qualities? And I just heard you say, just get out of the way, but do you get out of the way totally when you have those six freshmen in the hands of your, your leaders there? Yeah, right now the six freshmen are in the hands of our, our, our returners and then our assistant coaches, I get out of the way. You know, <laughs> it's, uh, you know we, we actually added a couple really good pieces to our staff. Mark Stevens came over from Toledo and then Everybody knows Kelly Kamara, um, member of the 99 National Championship team for Purdue. So a lot of great energy around our program, uh, but it is. So we have the five returners make, make it really, really easy, but we also have six young people uh, that really, really love Purdue and that are passionate about getting Purdue back to where we all hope it'll be one day. Cindy Brunson, Pac-12 Network. Coaches, you build on the success that you had last season. What do you think the identity of your team this season will be? Um, just, I think, just keep building on what we've been building, and that's just being a tough out. You know, being tough to beat every single night. Um, you know, we're we're chasing the likes of Iowa and Ohio State and Maryland and Indiana. We're chasing those guys, um, and and so just making sure we're a tough out. You know, along the way, maybe we we find an opportunity to to take one of those teams out. Um, but um, you know, we've got a long way to go to to get to to where those guys are. But we're um, we're just we want to stay the course um, every day and and just be a tough out. Really, that's what we we preach every day. You know, make sure we we compete every every second and and be hard to beat. <laughs> 